It's, it's a good level for others, but not for me. Okay, let's see what's this way, just for, yeah. I've seen quite a few, that's a, an element I've, I quite like, because I've seen it quite a bit, and it's pretty creative. Remember, trap buttons can be held down by multiple means. Okay, 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 I see. And they're gonna just tell me that I can use monsters for the trap buttons, as well as blocks, after I went through that level in which that monsters holding down trap buttons were the whole thing. Okay, so finally something a little more puzzly after all that chaos. Whoa, and there's a caterpillar there. Or a paramecium, or an amoeba, or a, a turd, a poop. What the heck, I don't know what I'm saying. I hope I didn't just disgust a whole bunch of people, but I'm sorry, if you've been playing this, you've been following this Let's Play this long, chances are you are mature enough to handle me talk, making an occasional poop joke. Seriously. Okay, what? that blew up the bomb, didn't it? So now, I guess I can get... I'm looking at this pink ball here, and I can see that it's lined perfectly up with a long corridor that goes down there, so I need to figure out how to get on the other side of it. Yeah, it's right there. So I need something to touch the, the trap button, which would be right there, maybe, question mark? All right, I'm just gonna throw myself into the fire here. No, it isn't. And I forgot it was going that way. I thought it was going up, so that was kind of funny. Okay, so the t tank, I should do it, oh, I can press the tank button twice, and then, wow, I'm, I'm making quick work of this level, definitely. This way, wait, what? There. Now it's holding down the button. Oops, forgot about that. Well, wow, damn it, what's with all these monsters roaming around? I hope there aren't any at the end of this level. And I almost forgot about the paramecium again. I think I should get a fire boot before I go in there. And that's right there, so I need to get the block over. Okay, now how to get it... Oops, is that the right block? I need... Uh-oh. I can come out of that teleport from the top. Okay, okay, I know how to do this. Now, I know my commentary isn't very interesting here, but I'm literally thinking what I'm... Th saying what I'm thinking. And that happens every time, so what? Maybe I have short-term memory loss. Okay, I need to use the block to blow up the bomb. Or do I? Okay, th the tank holds down... Wait a minute. I need a toggle button. There. Because I can get that block back later. So now I can bring the block down and put it on the button. This is a very creative... Whoa, oops, I forgot that. I forgot about the key down. Ooh, I got it. Okay, so I need to restart, but that ball killed me before I killed myself, so I will accept that. Because I need to use the key for something else. Whoa. If I were the level designer, I probably wouldn't have had that paramecium there, just because it's, it's kind of easy to miss. Okay, so I need to save... I can't use it there. Obviously, I need to find another key to do that.
Okay, now I get the block. And that's what that door is for. And then I can go around here. And it's just like one block Soko Ban. So, now how do I blow up the bomb? Okay, now that's open. So that's what that button does. So, whoops. Okay, now how do I get... Let's, I think I'm supposed to ram I. Please tell me the top section of that teleport is blocked out. I think it was. There's a, Yeah, there's a thin wall there. And I'm speaking my thoughts while making every dumb mistake in the book. But this is a great level. I'm loving it. This is definitely a big auto 2 level. Unlike the last level, which was more of a... I don't know. It's... I don't know. Tell me in the comments who you think would like that last level, because I'm sure there's people who would. It's just not... It wasn't my style. It wasn't a bad level, just not my style. I'll, I'll make that clear. And I don't need this yet. Okay. Boosting abuse. And I unlock the red door. I'm doing everything in a different order every time, which is confusing me. I think this goes here, down, and I just slid across the teleport because I forgot I could do that. Damn it. Damn paramecium. Why, why, why the freak does it? I really need to stop there and think, where's the paramecium? And I forgot to do the tank. Okay, gotta get the order in my head. Do this first. Then watch out for the paramecium. Press this button. No, 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 no. I just don't know what's with me. As you can see, I'm messing up in every... I'm lazy here. I need to go back. Do that. Then come down. Then two clicks. Now get out of here. Watch out for the paramecium. I remembered that time. Now, push this down. And then there's one other thing, which is over here. Undo this door. Undo this door. And then push this over and onto the button. I hope my recorder is recording. Watch out for the paramecium, as I remembered again. And then go in this way. Yes. So now I can use that teleport once I have it unlocked to get in there. Okay, now I bring... Now what... How does that pink ball come to use? I see. There we go. So the ball will come down, press the button, and then I can go over into that room and out using the pop-up walls. Let's try this. I'm going to do something a little different than what I would normally do, and that is just to save a bit of time. I don't know if this is any different or what, but... Okay, don't tell me I've screwed myself. Looks like I didn't. I can just do this. I shouldn't forget that the a teleport which is not connected to another teleport, obviously teleports don't connect because they, they just reverse reading order, but... Okay, now I'm going to go up and get the... Indy. Oh no. Alright, what did I miss? I know I took something off the button. Of course, I pressed the tank button. Did I? What did I take off? I cannot forget about whatever I did. So that can go there. First, God damn Bummer. it. I should not be saying that. That is offensive to many people. 
I wonder if I should cut that off, that out or if it's okay for this the purposes of this let's play. Either way, I'll try to stop swearing if I think it might be. Oh, oh, I should also get that chip. I don't want to miss any. Okay, so here's the button. So I need to have Yeah, I need to do that first thing. Mm. The order here is really confusing me, even though it's a great level. So far. So far, it's a great level. I'm noticing at the beginning that you need to not have an ice skate to be able to exit. Because it's that mechanic that I was talking about. So watch out for the paramecium. Come down here. Get ready to get the chip. Press the button wherever it is. I unlock it later, I guess. Do I? This is really confusing me. Mm. Okay, I've got the button pressed so I can go down there. Yes. So I need the button pressed three times, and the the ball is going to press it another time, so I might as well press it another time. Oh, come on. Why, why, why do I always forget? And good thing the paramecium isn't going to go in there. If it were a bee, it would have, because bees follow the left walls. Crap, how do I... Oh, I need to use the, the tank. So that means going in and getting that, which means going into the next section since I don't have anything more I can do here. Or wait. No, that's just the thief. Oh, I can go back this way now that I have the force boots, but the ultimate goal is to reach the thief. So I need to find another red key to get that last chip. So I guess that other toggle wall is to get out of here when I don't have force boots. I see what I'm supposed to do. Of course, I was just thinking silently, but what I need to do is... Where's the tank button? It was back up at the start. Oh no, it was down there. But I do see what I need to do and go this way because of the paramecium. Now in here. I'm not sure what that did. I don't think it was something near the end, but. Anyway, now I'm supposed to bring this block down and around and over here. Like that. There, now I've got the last chip. Now I can go get my boots taken away from me and and I will be good to go. interesting idea of a level because you actually have to get your boot your ice skate taken away your basically the ice skate is the enemy in this level and you have to get it taken away because you don't want it but you have to get it and you just can't get rid of it it's like it's like unwanted garbage yeah there we go i think it was someone else who first came up with this concept but but now JB is using it in his levels, which is a good, a good idea, as long as you don't copy the exact level, of course. So, yeah. Block and key. Now this is level 87, which in the original CC was the very, very tedious city block. So hopefully this level won't be like that. Oh, 
Okay, so there's keys underneath pretty much every block. There we go. Just push them all just to get all the keys and move them out. This is sort of like city block, I'm noticing. Hopefully it won't be as tedious, but it uses, or it utilizes blocks. See if I move them all, yep. Now I just gotta use them wisely and figure out what that clone button does. Which is probably one of the most annoying aspects of the game, is figuring out what the buttons do. You know, in the future I would really like, if there is a CC2, I'd really like to to make it clearer what the buttons do. Anyway, looks like it... Does it do what I think it does? It does. It toggles the doors, but only you can only do it once. So it's one of those situations where you have to get all the locks out. So that's a... I really like the concept myself, because it forces you to think ahead and plan ahead. So you gotta get the blocks out. Does that work? I don't think it... I guess it does, yeah. Okay, so I will have that. No, I won't. Yeah, I will. I will have access to that back room. So I could, I could store some blocks back there. But then again, I can't because the toggle door is always shut. But I can do that. And I can do this. Or can I? Yes, I can. No, wait. Fail. I need to be able to press the button, so... Right now I'm just looking for every possible way to store blocks in such a way that I can get them later. And did I just F up? I did. What did I do wrong? I should have done that, and then push the block out. So I could store them like that. Oh, damn it! That was a slip of my fingers. That does not count. What it's coming towards, I have no idea. It just doesn't count, if you know what I mean. Which I'm sure you don't. Okay, let's just try this. I'm not sure how it's, well it's going to work. Or if there's anything I'm missing. Okay, gotta do the doors. No! Why? I can't believe it. I get so far in a level. I'm, I'm going to rant about this, but I'm not ranting about the level. I'm ranting about my... how I just keep making missteps. This is... it's crazy. I get it all to the point where I'm... I'm ready to go, and then I just have to move my fingers in such a way that I fuck Over. up. Maybe there'll be a toggle button somewhere later on. Okay, where am I pushing blocks? I need to know where I'm going and stuff. And where is that? Got another cloner maze, which are starting to get repetitive. And I can move this block. It's annoying because I don't know where I'm cloning those two. I just have no idea. You've got to be kidding me. Okay, I'm stuck with nothing but a fireball cloner, and I don't even know where to clone to. I wonder if I should... Oh, there's a bomb over there. Okay, I'm going to do something cheaty here. I'm going to open another game in another window, and I'm going to window shop near the beginning of the level. Wow, this is very cheaty of me. Okay, I need to get... Maybe a fireball down there. Yeah, okay. 
get this command line out of here. I don't want to close it because then I'll get Tile World has stopped working, which would crash the game. So, so it needs to go right, then right, then right again, and then over there. So I think the first step has sort of been done for me, except I don't want them to clone again. Or do I? I kind of don't want them to clone again, yeah. Or maybe I should make it go... I don't know. I want this to be workable. Let's try this. Wait, 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 I have an idea. Okay, yeah, I'm, I just... Yeah, that certainly needed to happen. In fact, it would have happened either way, but I'm not going to restart yet, because I saw... No, that's not going to work, okay. Damn it. Okay, so I should set up the path first before I start cloning. The other question is, though, how the heck do I get over to that? I guess it would be, I don't know. I have the flippers now, so I think it's just over that way. In fact, I'm pretty sure it is. So I can push it in now without having to worry about it getting stuck. Okay, so I need two up there. Oh, geez, this is annoying. I just realized I have no way of getting them to follow the fire. I need fire boots, too, but obviously that wouldn't work in this way. Maybe if I make it turn right and go... Okay, just to try. Okay, I think I see a possibility. And I'll stress that this is just a possibility and not a solution yet. So I think if it goes right this way and then over, I, I'm going to need one to redirect it, of course. I'm going to need a few blocks here as many as I can get. Which looks like just two. This could be annoying. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Or no, maybe I don't. Annoyingly enough, this could be, this is a challenge. This is what this game is whole, all about. But I think I need to find myself an extra block. Yeah, I might need an extra block, which could be possible to do. If I do it properly. Yeah, 
here. I think I'm one block short here. Time we're trying something mm. a little mm. bit mm. different than usual, and that is that I'm going for higher audio quality by recording my video and audio separately using Hypercam to record just the video and in-game sound and then my voice through Audacity. So hopefully this will work out after. I'm just going to record through the end of this level and then then check it to make sure that it's working properly. And for this level I messed around with it a bit off-cam because last time I had an interruption and had to stop quickly so I was messing around a bit off-cam and of course, the solution to this level is actually pretty simple. And that is that it wasn't much that I was overlooking. I was doing it pretty much correctly, except I wasn't using the gravel tiles to my advantage. So I need to press the button, and there you can hear I have the, the button sound from Portal replaced with the normal button sound for this game which is, I don't know, I I just like to replace the sounds in this game that I don't like as much as other sounds, like like this game doesn't have the strongest sound, so I like to replace them with, you know, I know Rock Dead did that, so what the heck am I saying? I'm making no sense, but this fireball needs to turn left, so it's going to go that way, and as you can see I made a bridge there, and hopefully I'm making sense now. So it'll turn right and then right and then there needs to be another block down there if I can get it. And the button of course does nothing because it only works once. So over this way and that here I have three blocks since they turn right naturally I can use all three of these and it will turn right on the gravel square I'm standing on. And then I don't want to step in the fire by accident. That happened once off cam. So, it goes, um, yeah, so, this goes here, and this block over here goes, it's pretty obvious, it's just right here, and then this will direct the fireball down, and it will hit the bomb very simple level. So hopefully this will work. And I haven't forgotten anything. Okay. <clears throat> and I almost stepped in the fire there because I forgot it was there. Okay, so now I'm going to check to make sure this recorded properly. And I'll be back in a few minutes. <laughs> 